All right, what's going on guys? So for today's video, we are out here in the yard. We got the basket, we got 10 putters. And we're gonna be working on, you guessed it, some putting. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make a little series here that I'm gonna start off with where I have marked off here on the ground, 10 feet, 15, 20, 25, and 30 feet from the basket. I'm gonna start out by doing a warm up of Perfect Putt 360 and just kind of use that as you know baseline, get everything warmed up and hopefully get some good putts going. And then we're gonna start out by doing 20 putts from each of these distances to figure out kind of what our percentage is from each of those and keep track of what our most common misses for each of those areas. And then each of the videos following that in the series is gonna be hitting each of those distances and trying to improve and hit a certain percentage mark. So let's say I hit 80% from 15 feet. My goal for the next video might be only working on 15 feet and trying to get in that to 90% or 95%. And we're just gonna keep the series going from there. But all right, let's go disc golf. No way. Let's go! All right, so we're gonna start off here by getting our warm up with all 10 putters and we're gonna do both rounds of perfect putt 360 here and then get into the action. All right, so we just finished up our warm up on Perfect Putt 360. On the first round, we got 107, which we did pretty good. Second round, we only got 72. So we ended up with 179 on our warm up. And uh, now we're going to go do 20 shots from each of those distances and kind of get like an overall percentage of what I usually make and go from there. All right, so we're going to start out with our 20 putts from 10 feet and uh, see how many we make. All right, so as expected, we made 100% of them from 10 feet, so we got 20 for 20, and uh, pretty good. All right, so for this second set here, we're moving it back to 15 feet. We're gonna do our 20 putts and see what percentage of them we can make. All right, so we made all 20 of them from 15 feet as well, so we're 
rock another 100%, but it was good. All right, so now we're going into our third set, going back to 20 feet. We're gonna do our 20 putts and uh, see how many we can make from there. All right, so we made 19 out of our 20 there. Fortunately, we choked on the last one, but we got 95% from 20 feet, so I'm uh, surprised and really happy with that. All right, now for uh, set number four, we're going back to 25 feet, and we're gonna see uh, what we can do from there. All right, so we only missed uh, four there out of 20, so 16 out of 20, it's at 80%. I'll take that pretty good from 25 feet. All right, so we're going to do our fifth and last set now from 30 feet, and uh, we're gonna see what percentage we can make out of them. All right, so we ended up only making eight out of the 20 there. So we got 40% from 30 feet. So that's a good spot to really uh, know what I gotta work on. All right, so we just finished up video number one on putting. It actually went really well. I think I uh, really underestimated how helpful doing a warm up with a perfect putt 360 really was. Really got dialed in there on those shorter to medium distance. The 30 footers definitely uh, hit me a little hard, but uh, a really good time and I enjoyed it and I can't wait to uh, practice each of the distance individually to try and improve those percentages even more. All right, peace out.